Hello guys, BrickClick here, and today we have more LEGO leaks, so stay tuned to find out more. If you do enjoy the video, why not like the video and subscribe and turn on notifications to help us get to 70,000 subscribers, but let's get into it. So to kick things off, we have a much better look at the highly anticipated LEGO Ideas Botanical Garden. This one has been one which I've personally been looking forward to a lot this year. If you haven't know all the details of all this pretty impressive and pretty large set, it's going to be set number 21353, the LEGO Ideas Botanical Garden. Coming in with 3,792 pieces, the biggest ideas set of 2024. It's going to be retailing for the high price tag of three. $330 or £280 and it should be launching on November 1st 2024 so not long to wait less than two weeks away now and we can see the botanical garden in all its glory on that black box design definitely with the botanical garden being this white color it definitely stands out from the box art if we have a look at the back as well you can see the reverse of the botanical garden which is going to have a lot of cool architecture and these large windows in the green white and then the large open ones on the top and to the left of the model there will of course be the red tree lots of seating and flower beds out the front and then the actual building itself will be set back a little bit on the base plate but it does take up a massive 232 by 32 base plates so this one is going to be absolutely massive to display and if you have to look from the top down of course there is no sidewalk to make it modular but it's going to be incredibly detailed tiled within so this one can just fit into a modular street you just won't have the connections on either side some of the interior will include a cafe which is going to be good there's a, there's a seating area of course outside the botanical garden as well there will be an area where you can look over down on top top of the botanical garden and throughout these images you'll see the various foliage elements they've used to really create some detail and good looking plants throughout this model there'll be mini figures of visitors workers you'll see plenty of new pieces as well for botanical fans which are going to be great like a brand new tulip mold and also a rose and you can even just see how many displays and different building techniques will be included within this set so i think it'll be a real treat to display and also to build if you are a fan of lego modular buildings and also a fan of the lego botanical range i think everything about the set is pretty good i mean that price tag $330 is definitely a lot you are getting almost 4,000 pieces I think it's around 12 minifigures as well so it is going to be massive as well I don't think the pictures will do the size justice given this is two 32 by 32 base plates so essentially two modular buildings put together the original one was 32 and a 16 by base plate so they've added a 16 by 32 base plate onto the side of it to create this absolutely massive set when this one launches on November 1st there will be an exclusive entrance gate only when buying the botanical garden from November the first when stocks last you can see in this image where it will attach on the bottom i think it just slide into place rather than having any connections that will be a limited time gift we purchase though and will be included in one of these yellow boxes so if you find it on release like i probably will end up doing with this one you will get that gift we purchase for free and actually one other gift we purchase as we finally got images of the long-awaited like our ideas reading 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 promo this one is going to be a brand new gift we purchase coming later in the month which i got onto in the moment but it does include this tall bookshelf on a little black base that around also a ladder to get up to the different books there's going to be a seating area where the minifigure can read a book with a coffee stand some letters and also a plant then as we go up there will be a little globe on top some book holders and then just this massive bookcase with loads of different colors according to max bow on over on instagram it's going to be available from october 28th into november and that is going to be available with 130 dollars or 120 pounds spends on anything which is definitely good as this one feels like a pretty good promo for that threshold and of course if you are buying the botanical garden you will get this one as well if it does stay in stock until november and that pretty much will be the last promo until i got inside this weekend which is at the around the 23rd and 24th of november so i presume that we'll get um, some more promos then including probably two for that which will repeat on black friday and then two more christmas ones in december fans why to vix we do not 40700 is the christmas train promo this one should be my scale with 294 pieces the world itself includes a two green carriages train and also a black and green locomotive so essentially pretty similar to one we saw way back like 10 years ago now and hopefully that one will either be an insiders weekend one or a christmas promo in december but there's about four more promos left for 2024 let's hope like insiders weekend is just as good as last year then in early 2025 as well thanks to brick merge we know that 40707 will be the year of the snake promo this one essentially these promos we've seen over the past few years the brick animal which is the animal of the chinese new year for 2025 will be the snake
Then only this week, LEGO revealed, of course, the brand new LEGO Expansion, which is the latest in the addition to the LEGO Marvel modular building line. It includes a giant brick build sentinel, can attach in nine different ways to give you access. It is pretty much an ultimate LEGO X-Men modular. A lot of people are upset about the price of $330. Of course, you are getting 10 minifigures for that price tag, but definitely when you compare it to other Marvel modular buildings and put them side by side, it definitely does feel a little bit small, but I'm sure a lot of you will want to buy this one on November 1st to get all those awesome minifigures and of course we will be getting an exclusive promo from november 1st as you can see on screen now this one only available when buying the x mansion and of course if that reading 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 promo also stays in stock you can potentially get x mansion the exclusive gift of purchase and reading reading so there's plenty some good promo stacking to come on november 1st if you want to pick up the x mansion the botanical garden or something else to get that ideas promo and of course as always if you do want to stay up to the latest like on news you can follow me on instagram over at break underscore clicker but now we'll get on to one of my favorite themes which show one of the best sets of 2024 being of course Lego Notre Dame. This is the Lego architecture theme. A few of you have been asking what's going to happen in 2025. According to Brit Merge, one set in the first half of next year we just know is 21062 for now under the architecture theme. It is though going to contain 1,880 pieces and should be retailing for $160. From that we can make a few assumptions. This one probably is one large build one monument like Notre Dame or also the pyramid we saw in 2022. That one is going to be launching on March 1st 2025 so we're not having to wait until the summer but he pretty much confirms there will be no skylines in the first half of 2025 but fingers crossed in the second half and let's just put your predictions in the comments what you think a big architect set will be coming in March then on to LEGO R that will also be getting two more sets according to Brick Merge in the first half of next year one big one being 31215 with 2,615 pieces for $200 that one launching on May 1st 2025 from that assumption we can guess it's probably something in a frame with a lot of smaller pieces or some layers like we saw with the Milky Way or also the Mona Lisa painting. And before that though, 31214, 791 pieces for $80. This one launching in January 1st, 2025. From the price and the piece count, we can assume this one is probably more of a freestyle art like the Rolling Stones on the McCall Parrots and that should be coming out in January. So exciting stuff for Lego art and architecture. And then last year, we kind of thought Blacktron could have been coming back but it turned out it was the Pharrell Williams over the moon set. But thanks to a new uh, rumour from Kramer, it seems Blacktron could be returning in some form in 2025. That's pretty much all the details we know for now. There's a couple of routes they could go down. They could do a brand new gift of purchase for Blacktron, or they could do a larger remake like we saw with Eldorado Fortress. There's definitely a lot up in the air, but there's a lot of evidence so far pointing to LEGO Blacktron in 2025, which so many of you are going to be excited about. So if you're getting more information, I will let you know on that. Now we're going to move on to LEGO Magazines, what's coming in the next few months for the LEGO Minecraft one. We are going to be getting a player skin, a little bit of a swamp terrain, a frog, and all sort of slime. So once again, like I seem to mention every time in the Minecraft magazine, some really good value with this one. In the LEGO Marvel magazine, we'll be getting a generic Iron Man minifigure, I believe, but they will have a lot of Power Blast pieces for his hands and his legs, which are cool to pick those up at a cheap price point. And for LEGO Dreams, we will get in the evil version of Logan, I believe. That one should be coming in the next LEGO Dreams magazine. I just speaking of LEGO Dreams, we do know the set names for 2025. These are going to include Cooper's Tiger Mech and Zero's Hot Rod Racer for $100. We have 71491 one Mateo and Z-Blob Action Race Car. That one coming in for $50. We have 71490 Izzy and Bunchuro's The Gaming Bunny for $20. And finally, 71489 Cooper's Gaming Controller Jet for $20. So these are definitely leaning into that gaming or technic or sci-fi like we saw with some of the Summer Wave, like Z-Blob's Mech and also Cooper's T-Rex. And there will also be two smaller, more creative style sets for LEGO Dreams, including Bunchu's Creative Animal Adventures for $10 and also Z-Blob's Robot and Vehicle adventures for ten dollars and all those lego dream sets are going to be launching on january 1st 2025 and we also already had a look of course of the dreams poly bag which once again confirms to us it will be heavily gaming themed i was speaking about those poly bags which we saw last week it does turn out these are going to be brand new lego paper poly bags so for decades basically lego has always had the poly bags in a plastic but they will be switching to paper in 2025 which definitely be interesting can't wait to get one of these on hands and see what they're like and that major switch which has probably been coming for a while as we saw with collectible minifigures. Then over the past few years, LEGO Friends has definitely upped its game with some pretty interesting designs. I'm going to go through a few sets according to Brick Merge coming in early 2025, which definitely piqued my interest. These include 42670, the Heartlet City Apartments and Stores. This one, the biggest set of 2025 with 2,040 pieces for $170. We have 42669, the Beekeeper's House and Flower Garden. This one could be coming in with 1,161 pieces for $100. I presume this one will be similar to the Ben 
breakfast, which look, could look pretty incredible. 42655 will be the restaurant and cooking school. This one with 896 pieces for $80. We have 42649, the Heart Lake City candy store. This one, a bit of a smaller one with 376 pieces for $30. Friends have been really good at buildings lately, so those could also be pretty impressive. 42663 is the camper van adventure with 778 pieces for $60. And 42656 is the Heart Lake City airport and airplane. No price or piece count on that one yet, but all of those are launching on January 1st, 2025. I'm really excited to see these. Friends are definitely putting out some pretty good sets, so roll on January 1st. And then in LEGO China, they are going to be getting this exclusive gift with purchase. You can see on screen now. I think this one is some sort of mythical mountain goat or sheep, something like that. You can correct me in the comments, but it is really cool in this kind of yellow, white, and blue color scheme. So it does really pop, and it does look like a really fun thing to have on display. But sadly, this should be available only in Asia or China specifically for a certain selected time. But if you live in that region, definitely try and get this one if you can, as it does look pretty awesome. Speaking of regional exclusives over in America, there is this exclusive Mario Scale Pod Racer currently running. This is free when you buy $65 or more of LEGO Star Wars from Walmart. And when you bought it, you have to then upload your receipt to a website and you do get this in the post. So definitely check that out if you live in America and you're buying LEGO Star Wars from Walmart. But some definitely some exciting stuff today. Cannot wait for that Botanical Garden on November 1st. And I also to get that brand new LEGO Ideas promo. Expansion is good, maybe a little bit expensive, but I think I'll eventually end up picking it up. I cannot wait to see those brand new Christmas gift with purchase and what Balcron could potentially hold in 2025. As with the friend sets, it could really blow us out of the water. So that was some huge new LEGO leaks and rumors. Comment down below, what are you excited for? What are you not? If you like the video, subscribe and turn notifications for LEGO videos or LEGO news videos. Watch any videos on screen now. Remember guys, keep clicking and breaking. I'll see you all later guys. Bye bye.